Okay, today we're going to do some fatherless behavior type content. As some of you may know, if you follow social media, there's an NBA player called Zion Williamson, and he's found himself in a little bit of a pickle these last couple weeks with two women specifically. It's a pretty big story right now. It's going viral online, and there's a few lessons to be learned here. Roll the clip. Ah, damn, this shit is a mess. So as we know, Zion Williamson was mad happy cheesing because he having a baby with a 30-year-old IG thought, and now his piece star side chick Mariah Mills got to exposing him, talk about some, you thought I wasn't going to find out. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm familiar with Mariah Mills' work. This is a C-tier level actress. That's the best you could do, Zion. This is bad, bro. She got screenshots of him asking her to be his girlfriend. Him asking her, how much do you want me to pay you a month? I'm super excited, lame ass nigga. Zion, you already got exposed in college by some snow bunny thoughts, and now you letting it happen to you in the league? This is crazy. She over here talk about some tapes, how you got that thought pregnant when she 29 with an adult child already. Her calling Zion's girl a is crazy she's not wrong but for that to be coming from her of all people is hilarious she said i told you you was gonna be the next king the next lebron i motivated you i don't know why she was lying to him like that and what i showed was just a couple screenshots if you go to the full thing she put out a harry potter book of tweets and screenshots exposing bro i know zion's sick right now okay did you catch that a basic summary is he's done a gender reveal with his missus then some adult actress has came out of the woodworks and said wait there i was with you as recent as last week and we've done sex tapes together and now it's all blowing up in his face talk about picking the wrong girls to get with if you mess with these types of women you're asking for trouble women can both build you up and support you but they can also destroy you but at the end of the day the responsibility still falls on the man it's up to him to pick the right woman to coach that woman to condition her for lack of a better word you have to get your missus onto your program you have to get her to adopt your values your beliefs your worldview so then she can be the best support role so you can be on the field as the quarterback and she can be the cheerleader and then that is how you work together synergistically then but instead these players have got to train multiple times a day they're on the court they're having these tough grueling games and then what do you think they have to go home to with these type of women i told you i seen that girl she a hoe i told you don't play with me you know what that's what these girls are like imagine having to go home to that every single day we know men just want peace Sex and silence, the three S's. Women don't understand, it's actually very easy to keep a man happy. They just need to do less. <laughs> and the funny thing is, is these NBA players will never learn despite the patterns being laid out right in front of them from the other NBA players. One thing I've learned in business is you should have positive mentors who you learn what to do from. And then you should also have negative mentors who you learn what not to do from. And these NBA players don't learn from each other. And they're all getting burned right now. If I was an NBA player, I'd just wrap up every single time because there's a lot of them going through similar sort of things. Here's a few more examples. 2019 NBA draft class is already cooked because Zion is about to become an adult film star. Ja keeps showing his glizzy on social media. RJ Barrett is Canadian. PJ Washington got finessed and his pain child support. See, that's the thing when you're an athlete you've got all the options in the world and you just think that you're invincible you just got given 20 million your social media profiles blowing up you've got endorsement deals sponsorships every girl wants to be with you every man wants to be you you've got people cheering your name and you get caught up in the glitz and the glamour i'm speaking about this like as if i've got experience and listen i have on me little tiny level because when i first became a gym owner back in the days when there really wasn't that many private gyms i'd be out and girls would be like what you doing i'd be like oh i've got my own gym and they'd be all over me trying to get a piece of that cake but i'd be like stay away you'd only want me for me money now this stupid stripper has been going on a bit of a social media campaign recently to try and get zion cancelled from the nba she's using these sex tapes as blackmail she's tagging the nba on twitter telling them if they don't release him from the team then she's going to release the sex tapes like as if that is going to give it any sort of leverage in this situation this woman actually threatened to release a homemade adult tape of herself and williamson saying quote nba i have tapes of me and zion williamson and he also has them on his trap phone trade him now he doesn't deserve to be in new orleans Six tapes dropping soon why would he not deserve to be in new orleans is the pope residing there and somebody forgot to tell us why would that be a reason to trade zion williamson mariah mills what is wrong with you respectfully seriously what's wrong with you why are you publicizing stuff like that she knows that she's got no leverage in this situation she's obviously just bitter the hair plan to get him cancelled isn't working out and she's trying to double down on it and double down on it see in situations like this it's the man who's cheated it's the man who's done the dirty but the woman is actually coming out on the worst end for it the best thing that he can do is just keep his head down 
down, play the game and don't get pulled into it all. But luckily enough, the internet gods have spoken and it's backfired on it. Check this out. National nightmare is over. Mariah Mills has been suspended on Twitter. Word to Zion. It looks like the tweets I got her suspended was her borderline blackmailing the NBA with her and Zion's tapes, but doesn't matter. Her account's suspended, her Instagram's suspended. Zion has beat the charges. That's right, city boys up. She was trying to get him canceled. She got herself canceled. Thank you, Elon, you are the G. We gotta show these adult actresses that you can't just get your own way all the time. You've been too busy living your life on recruit difficulty. That's life on easy mode for my non-gaming audience out there. And now you're getting a little dose of accountability thrown your way. Unlucky girl, maybe next time. <sighs> feel better. Doesn't it feel good to see people getting a dose of accountability and people being punished for their bad behavior? But she's probably not going to realize what she's truly done. She won't change forever. This is deeply ingrained fatherless behavior. So boys, remember, we must be there as fathers for our daughters and your sons as well, because you can't be raising any simps. How would you feel if your son was out there Snapchatting women, asking them how much money they want? Screw that. Hey boys, if you like this type of content, give me a like. If you like raw hip hop music, check out my music down below. I've got a new tune dropping this Friday, every single Friday. New music, new tunes. Tunes which are great for the gym, by the way. So make a warehouse playlist and add me to it. And here's some more videos like this one, if you're a fan of this type of content. Okay, I'll see you all tomorrow.